Welcome to Collecting Chaos. My name is James and this is not a cleaning video. <laughs> uh, I picked up some comics, uh, partial trade and a little cash was uh, changed hands but for the most part it was a trade. Uh, and I thought I'd show them to you. Now, I went ahead and took them out of the box. Uh, the packing for the box was adequate. I wouldn't exactly write home about it uh, uh, to my mother if she was still alive. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it was adequate. I'll put it that way. There was no reinforcement on the box or anything like that. But still, uh I thought I'd share them with you. I haven't looked at them. I don't know if they survived the shipping process or not, uh, but we'll find out. Uh, so, uh, yeah, we'll get started right after this. And you may want to watch this to the end because it might be a pretty good video. Take about half of them. And uh, yeah, let's start looking at them. What did we get? We got the Joker number 11. Looks to be in pretty nice shape. Don't have it, so that's that's cool. Old Lady Harley number 5. I don't have, I didn't have any of the Old Lady Harley series, so that's good. Looks like it took a little bump here. A cold press will fix that up, no problem at all. And I do not uh, do a heat press on any new comics, uh, only a cold press. Warlock. Yeah. I think that was part of a lot. This is a Mylar that got... Uh, <laughs> I'm not impressed with that at all. You don't bend mylars over. I'm sorry. Just get a bigger backing board. I think this is an exclusive. Oh yeah. Gilbert Hernandez. Can't go wrong with Hernandez. Good stuff there. The Blood Spinners, number two of four. Dark Horse Originals. Like that. That'll keep... True Believers, Avengers, probably not going to hang on to this. I might because it has Captain Marvel, but I doubt it. 4001 AD, this is a Loot Crate exclusive from Valiant. We'll hang on to that for a while. Batman 357 in an oversized Mylar. Okay. Facsimile edition. That's all right. I don't have the regular one or the facsimile, so we'll hang on to that. I don't mind facsimile editions. This is another facsimile. And it reminds me of my one regret uh, when selling comics was when I sold my Hulk 1 through 6. That is my one regret of sales. And that includes, you know, Amazing Spider-Man, uh, Amazing Adventures, uh, Amazing Fantasy, Amazing Adult Fantasy, all of those. Because I did have 1 through 15. So. Hulk number 10. Kind of a nice cover. I like Hulk. Probably going to keep my Hulk. Darth Vader, black, white, and red variant. Don't care about Star Wars. Green Lantern Core. I don't think I have this one. That's cool. We like that. Hellcat number two. I like this uh, throwback style. I don't know if that's a crease or if that's the comic. I think that's just the way the comic is made. I'll probably hang on to that for a while. 
Captain Marvel, number one. This is True Believers, a reprint from <coughs> Marvel Tales. I, I don't remember. Uh, Mar Marvel Special Edition, number 16, I think it was. I might be wrong on that. Still, I'll, I'll hang on to that because that's kind of cool. And I like I like uh, Marvel, the original Captain Marvel uh, from from Marvel Comics. Avengers, Red Guardian, don't care. Noctera. I do like that. I like Noctera. Harley Quinn number 27. I don't have that one. Guardians of the Galaxy, Bane of Blast Star. That's something I probably will end up getting rid of. Don't care much about Guardians of the Galaxy. Batman number 100. I'm missing this. It sold out at my LCS before I could uh, get to my LCS and I went there the day after it came out. So people were buying two and three copies. Dawn of DC. Harley Quinn number 31. I don't have that. Titans number two. I don't have that. This is going to go in my do some cleaning and minor repair pile. Probably going to get up, end up in my collection. It's a shame about this tape pull. Can't fix a tape pull. I'm sorry, I can't do that. Superboy number 133. Pretty sure I don't have this one. It's going to go in that pile for to get cleaned and pressed. Red Sonia from Dynamite number 8. Pretty good. Red Sonia, Red Sitha, number four, number three. And some of these I might have, I just don't recognize the covers. Red Sonia Fairy Tales, number 21. Two copies of that. I'll put them both over there and pick out the best one for myself and sell the other one. Number 19. Killing Red Sonia, number 4. And finally, Immortal Red Sonia, number 5. Lindsner cover. That's why I bought these Red Sonias was for this one cover right here. <laughs> There you go. That's it. Um, for those of you that stayed till the end, I appreciate it. Uh, if you're not subscribed, I ask that you do so. If you were, uh, you know, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and recommend it to your friends. And if you didn't like it, well, give it a thumbs down and and tell me why in the comments why you didn't like it. And if you didn't, and you can tell me why you liked it too. I, I don't mind that. Uh, I'm not doing a cleaning video today. It's um, 95 degrees in this room already, and it's only like, uh, it's not even 9 o'clock in the morning. Uh, I cannot do a video with the air conditioning running for obvious, well, it, probably not obvious to you, so I'll, I'll show you why. Yeah, it, it cools down the room really good, but it makes so much noise I can't do a video with it. Uh, I even turned the fan off for this one. Uh, I'm going to go uh, wash my hands and a few other parts of my body and uh, maybe just take a shower because <laughs> it's, it's pretty bad. And uh, it's supposed to get worse today, so that's the way it is. Hey, I live in Texas, so... I have to take the bad with the good. Uh, everybody have a wonderful day and we will talk to you again on Thursday. That's when my next video should drop. Hopefully I'll have a chance to do some cleaning. Maybe I'll turn the air conditioner on and do some cleaning and then just dub over telling you what I'm doing. I don't know. I'm not sure how to do that yet.
uh, I'm still learning a lot of things about making these. In the meantime, have yourself a wonderful day. And don't forget, before you handle your comics, make sure you wash your hands. It's good for your comics, but more importantly, it's good for your health. And we'll see you Thursday. Bye.